is going in some Well, that's we're we're going to try to look at how you can create a better business environment, and and that's that is in turn going to create jobs, uh, and that's what we want to work for. And I think ours are going to be very similar. And, and it's not that we're going to come out with like a top 10 and try to pass them out quick and establish what our credentials are. Uh, what we're going to try to do work with the House, work with the governor, uh, not where we start, but figure out where we want to finish. So the House may come with a lot of the bills that you've seen us have in the past. Uh, it's just a matter of them being prepared uh, and ready to move. You obviously mentioned a lot of bills that, that have already gone through the Senate multiple times, right. only to be sort of uh, uh, stalled in the House. Uh, any surprises you, I guess, maybe anticipate folks, issues that... Uh, I, I, I don't, let me tell you this. When, and, and if you heard, I'm, we, we've had our institution, the institution of the Senate has been established and around for many years. They're just building their institution. So, so anything that happens won't really surprise me. Either it being a little slower or a little quicker than what I would expect, uh, issues to, to change some, and and being somewhat a little bit different than what we thought, or a little bit different than what the governor thought. Uh, you know, it, you, you've got 64 distinct and different personalities, but the general concepts I think will be very similar to what you've seen the Senate deal with in the past. On the business climate, so you expect this session will repeal prevailing wage and adopt right to work? I'm hoping. Again, it, it is it is not that that we will, you know, if we don't get it this session, we'll look for next session. But I think, you know, when you look at the month of February, I think you're going to have a lot of riding, Jack. Leader Shell on charter schools seems to say that they have some Republican members that may say, let's go slow on this. Well, and that's that goes back and why I tried to draw that distinction on the panel. We've been here. You, you, we're a known commodity. You've got 20 some odd new members of the Republican caucus, but you've also got five or six, maybe seven new members of the Democrat caucus uh, in the House. So, you know, they're still educating themselves on a lot of the issues and the nuances of the issues.